Hey guys, Robert Tramp Renegade here. Wanted to do a quick video. We got some projects we're gonna work on on uh, my brother's van, so check it out. All right, guys. So here's what we're gonna do today. On the last video that we did uh, about my van, there were some people that had some questions about how the bed and the couch work. So uh, I hadn't really done it and finished it up yet. So we're gonna do that today. I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna do it. Um, we build the legs to hold it up and then we also got to do some trimming on the mattress that way it'll work right and then when we're done uh, we'll show you how we did it and maybe you can use it for the ideas on your so what we have here basically just a simple design I built when I built my bed, I built the frame, I built three quarter plywood uh, as the base. Um, I've got in the middle between each strip I have a one by where it's hinged and that way I can flip it up on both sides. So now you got the couch that faces forward, you just have a brace here with a hinge on the inside and a hook just to hold it. Um, same thing on the other side. So, as you can see, I have plenty of storage underneath, underneath the uh, bed. Flip it up, slide it from the back, however you want to do. So to put it down, just drop these down. They, they rest right on the things there. Pull it down, pull the bed down. Now, this mattress that I got, it's just a full-size mattress for a height of bed. So it was a little bit big. 72 inches long the van itself is only 67 68 with the inside so I cut it as you know tight as I could make it fit without taking too much away from it we cut it in the middle that way it would articulate a little bit better but it's a just a five inch foam mattress for like a hide a bed so we go to the other side here so Basically, the other side, this side, it's the same way. You can raise it up. You got a couch facing out the back. Say you go to a drive-in movie, you go to the lake, you want to have a nice view. Same thing, you know, you just raise these up on each side, put the hooks in, and you got access to your storage here from the inside. So, uh, that's basically it. If you have any questions, just uh, put in the comments down below. And I'll try to answer them as best I can. But uh, it's pretty simple. Uh, got the idea from Adventure Van Man. It's a little bit different than he did it, but it's pretty much the same basic setup. So go check out his videos and uh, keep watching Seth's videos. See you later.